Hello and welcome, I'm ItBitIt, let's play some more Europa Universalis 4. We made peace with Syria and I just did something stupid, I exiled my troops and let's core this province, it's not the most expensive to core. And what are we going to going to do to you. Let's go over here. Hitchas, I want you to return course to Iraq. Like all of them. How much was court do we need? 92 and I want your money. 94% was court. That might take some time. But we will get there, we will get there, I tell you. Unfortunately we can't and Muscovy accepted peace, that's annoying. They probably got even some provinces out of them. one probably that's disappointing that just means I have to siege the provinces up there again we get we are not even at 25% Vosqua control thingy and we have six galleys over here they have five big ships over here And we defeated his army down there. Well, well. Just increase the war score and we will get there eventually. And how about we end this war and just take... Just don't take lower done. This one. We're still not willing. Interesting. How about I send half of my men up there to occupy your provinces? And of course we get the bad event again that reduces our diplomatic reputation. And the game started to lag. Apparently something big happens. Big big safe. Come on game, don't leave me hanging, that's just annoying. Game, please. Okay, please. Please, please. Please don't shut down, that would be so annoying. You can't see it, but the screen from the game became white and it's not responding. You can just see that it's auto-saving forever. Okay, I... Okay, sometimes this happens. Okay, okay, okay. Let's go and siege those provinces and be fine. And the war up there. Come on game. I told you no freezing allowed. I'm building ships. How about I build more galleys? And Okay. Apparently the pause shortcut doesn't work anymore. The Moogles are offering peace. No, I don't want you to 
give these provinces to me. I want you to give them to the Golden Horde. They are getting close. They will accept peace eventually. And he's of course coming for us here. And I can't pause with my short key anymore. That's very annoying. How about you, dear sir, take for a forced march over here. You split in half and go over there. And you go over here. Not being able to use the short keys is really annoying. I'm so used to using them. Having to click the stop time thing manually is just annoying. And we crush them, of course. Let's combine the army and let's actually detach a siege and go down here. That's so annoying. Annoying. Let's detach another siege and go and hunt them. Hunt them down. Okay, let's go and crush the small stack in Mecca. We have won another siege. How about you go and occupy that province? And teach us, are you willing to accept peace with me? I want you to... Release? No, not release. Releasing the Mamelukes. Interesting. Only 63% war score. I want you to return all those cores. No, not yet. But you, sir, accept my peace offer. And we can get even more money out of them by waiting just one more month. Or two. Just have to win one siege. Okay. I can support the reform. I will lose patriarch authority because I don't need to convert stuff and let's lose diplomatic power I want to be friends with Naples for once and we are sieging more provinces we have won some siege. Come on, game, please stop. Okay, we have won two sieges. One over here. Let's go and siege Judea and one over here. How about you, sir, go do Najd? And over here. We need just to take one more province. Come on, finish the siege up there. It's silly. Still no. Okay, maybe they will just accept now. Okay, they are very close to accepting. And we have lost the siege. That's unfortunate. But we will win that one right now. And now He's going to accept peace, right? Of course you are. And you give me your money. The golden horde is growing again. It's awesome. And we will annex all of that. Just one more war and I think... Ooh, Lithuania has annexed that province. I want to go to war with Lithuania for that province. 
Ooh, Lithuania is pretty tempting. I just wish I had the chance to go to war with them. And France is at war with... Muscovy. That's interesting. Maybe France starts to lose power. Let's see. We are... Who has the most men? France, of course. And France is becoming even more powerful. Muscovy is not that powerful yet. But they will be. And we've got some Mamalukian nationalists. And we have won the Siege of Basra. Okay, let's see. Are you willing to accept my rightful demands now? No. I will let the Mamelukes siege some lands over here. I want the Mamelukes to respawn. That will be awesome. And let's see, I have 5% neighbor's pony. How about I build more stuff, more constables? Constables, constables, more constables. Ooh, it's 1.6 ducats. And workshops. Okay, building some workshops. Workshops also increase your manpower, that's why they are so awesome. Not just money, also manpower. They are just good buildings. Like the trade depot. Trade depots are awesome. And those Mamalukian uh, rebels might become a problem for Hichas. If I would destroy the whole Hichasan army, they will become much stronger. The peasants might be able to enforce demands and form the Mamelukes again, which would be awesome. Can I probably accept demands from them? No, just Syrians. Because I don't own the provinces, that's sad. We have one, one siege over here, so how about you go down to like here? And we have one that siege. So which... okay, so this siege was also won by me. How about you go down here and they don't want to engage us anymore. They are running away. And you are also coming. Okay, let's combine them and go down here. Here are some Iraqi troops. And are you willing to accept my demands yet? Still no. But you're getting to it. That's fine. That's fine. We have more Mamelukians and we have won the siege. Oh, okay, so apparently my guys, my uh, Iraqi troops decided to engage the Mamelukian rebels. I don't want that. I want them to succeed. I like those Mamelukian rebels. And how about you go down and crush this army? 
we have one another siege and we have another revolt. But I will sadly destroy them. The question is, will my vessels help them if I support them? Let's see. Hey Jas, how, I ba oh, how about I support your rebels? Uh, those Mamalukian dudes over here with very little money just barely enough to be friendly to them and of course they won't siege anything they will just become stronger oh damn it but I won this siege anyway this battle and now they should be willing to accept my rightful demands. Yes. Perfect. Let's send. And fine. And now we can annex Iraq. Because the Iraq won't get any bigger. Iraq, can I annex you yet? An ex vessel? I need five more years. How disappointing. How disappointing that is. Bosnia, please. Okay, I will annex Bosnia right at the end of the month. Stop game, please. We can convert provinces now. Coring is coming along nicely here. We have nearly no war exhaustion. And Hungary. You might have some patriot patriotic rebels. You're still at war with Lithuania, Denmark, Norway and Poland. Lithuania. You are at war with Sweden and you're losing badly. That's what you get for attacking Sweden. And Muscovy is at war with Lithuania. So they somehow got pulled into this war. Maybe they will force Lithuania to release Crimea or something like that. Genoa, you are allied with still only Switzerland and Venice. You are our next target, so how about we go and take... Like force them to release Crimea and then go for Crimea. This however would require huge amounts of Vosco and they have one province over here. So we might not be able to do that. We should fabricate the claim somewhere around here. I will think about that. Okay guys, thanks for watching, I will see you in the next episode where I think about our next goal, about our next target, maybe Syria, let's see, Syria still has like 3 years or something like that. Damn, I wish we could restore the Mamelukes. You have how many provinces from the Mamelukes, Libya? Only one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's too much, that's too much. I want the Mamelukes to respawn with as little provinces as possible so I can annex them. Maybe I will force Hichas to release them. I don't know. Okay, thanks for watching. I will see you in the next one. Bye!